Father. What? Father. Well, Father. Again? Well, you see, it's like this. Like what? It's not easy to explain, Father. If not easy, then come back when I prove you the paper. Better now, Father. I need money. Money? What money? Well, you see... Well, you see... I'm busy. I need money. Need money? Aren't you working already? Yes, but it's not enough, Father. How much are you earning? 800, Father. 800? You're earning almost as much as your father. Don't understand me, Father. I don't understand. Don't misunderstand me, Father. Aba, you just said, I don't understand. That means I'm not capable in understanding. Now you say, not to, not to misunderstand, that I am capable in understanding. Pala. Make up your mind, Roberti. Well, you see, Father, what I'm driving here is that I, I want my own allowance back. Jablos, you want your own allowance? You're working and earning 800. You don't pay me a single centavo for your board and lodging in. I have so many expenses, Father. How much have you got saved up in the bank? How many I save up anything, Father? So you have nothing in the bank. What kind of gifts do you give for your girlfriend? I... I... Flowers? When do I do the best flowers? The Hombre Este. When I was courting your mother, I used to give her only balot or money. Yes, I remember quite well. You only knew when my mother used to say, I'm afraid to give me money or money. Come on, Petra, the son of ours is earning 800. He doesn't give us a centavo for our house expenses. And on, on top of that, he asking for his old allowances. Where in the world have you heard such a thing? I know they for children work and don't give their parents any money and still ask for the allowance. Where? In the Philippines. Baba, Baba, how do you see that you are, Petra? You're not going to get a centavo. But mother! If you have no money to ride in a taxi, take a jeepney. Jeepney? To visit a girl? I. I what? Francisco! Huh? I'm calling the servant. Demonstrate with the servant. Have you the same name as the owner of the house? I'm going to pick him up soon. He broke your plate again. Again? I don't know why he always breaks my plates. He never breaks your plates or the burning nenas. No, he breaks only my plates. Yes, I know. But imagine a Filipino girl going to the party without a chaperon. After all, she didn't go out with friends alone. She's with her friends, Lolita and Lodin. Yes, those two girls. Since they arrived from abroad, they've been trying to teach our daughter all the wrong things they learned from those places. Wrong things? Ay! You exaggerated! Francisco! Are you through with that but soon? We finished it last night, senora. Last night? Oh, but senora. But I forgot where I placed it. Stupid ay tong taong ito! Let me see! What that is, muchacho? Alright, hang it outside at the window. I said outside, not inside! I, Francisco, he had to be my name, say. As I was saying, Francisco. You were talking to me, Petra, or to the servant. Francisco, what are you still doing here? Go back to the kitchen! You were saying, Petra? As I was saying, I think you're being very unfair to Nena after she's grown up. Petra, my dear, virtue is ageless. I know that, Francisco. But chaperoning is rather old-fashioned. Old-fashioned? Maybe in some civilized countries. But isn't it the Philippines civilized? In many ways, yes. But in some ways, it's uncivilized. Hi, Francisco. It's attorney the Balagdan is our great patriot. patriot. Should hear you now. Where did you get that idea of this Balagdan? First name is Saturnino. You mean Francisco? Saturnino, Francisco, both and in all. Yes. That's why you call out my name, Francisco the Muchacho Rajas Eve. Anyhow, our women can take care of themselves. Are you sure? Especially if they receive an education, for instance. Her nena is in her senior year in education at the University of Santo Tomas and even taking some courses in home economics. I suppose that makes her immune from any moral faults. Moral faults? Francisco! Hi! Exagerado naman to. No, what I mean that Nena is better, educated, and more enlightened to take care of herself. This Petra naman? You don't see the point. Education, even a university education, with all the letters of the alphabet after the graduate's name. A, B, B, S, E, L, M, B, P, H, D, is not moral education. Training the mind is not training the heart. But if the mind is trained, why the heart will be, will be 
ruled by the mind. No, Petra. If a person is intellectual, it doesn't fact make immoral immoral. It's the fact that very deep for me, for me naman, Francisco. Very deep? Our daughter Nena will fall in a deep water if we don't watch out. Ah, you're so apprehensive, Francisco. Francisco! Did you call me, Senora? Or you? Yes, Senorito. I am married to the Senora. Therefore, I'm not the Senorita anymore. I am the senior, understand? Yes, Senorito. I'm going to change your name. By now on, I will call you Francis. Francis. Yes, Francis, understand? Why not come in, sir? Because I don't want it. Now you get out. Father, do you get a taxi? Your mother told you to take a jeepney. But I'm visiting my girlfriend. Visiting girls at this time of the day? It's nearly lunchtime. She called me up. She says I must see her. It's very important. You went to the party on Chaperon? Does Roberti need the Chaperon? I'm not talking about Roberti. I'm talking about the girl who took out. What do you want? What do I want? Have you got any manner? I said, whom do you want to be? Why don't you speak more dearly? What shall I tell the owner of the house? Who's the owner of the house? The senora, of course. Why? Is she a widow? Not yet. Tell your senora I want to see her. Which senora? How many senoras do you have in this home? The senora Petra, the senora Nena. Gago, call senora Petra then. Oh, good morning. Have you been waiting long? No, I just talked to senora. Oh yes, why don't you sit down? I will. Did you come in some business? Business? Oh, business of sort. Oh, that's good. That's nice. You're loading your robe you're wearing. You like it? I'm certainly going to buy one like that. Oh, thank you. Imitation they say is a subtlest form of Latin. Of course, mine will be more expensive. Undoubtedly, you must be a man of means. Of me? Sort of... Mm, I wonder what's delaying Francisco. Francisco? I'm Francisco. You're Francisco? Yes. Well, if you're Francisco, the senora told me to ask for instructions. Instructions? What kind of instructions? I suppose she meant instructions for washing the dishes and all sorts of things. Dishes, all sorts of things? What do you mean? Aren't you the servant here? Servant? I'm the owner of the house. Oh, you're the owner of the house? I suppose this is the way to the kitchen. Petra? Petra? Where's the Sunday paper? Oh, so you're awake. How was the party last night? So, so... Father, where's the movie page? Probably your better your birthday was going on. You're awake at last. Have you had breakfast? Breakfast when it's nearly 12. How was the party? So, so... Aba! Where's the cigars, Petra? Why? I have played half a dozen there this morning. Half a dozen? I've only smoked one Essex bar. I wonder. I'm wondering too. Ah, uh, excuse me. Wait, Nena, sit down. What is it, Father? Did you come to the party alone last night? Miss Francisco naman, I told you she went out with Fred. Anyhow, I hope that was the first and last time that you were going to the party and chaperon. But there's nothing wrong, Father. After all, I'm an educated girl. Yes, Francisco. She can take over herself. Can you see? She's educated. So, you're awake. How was the party last night? So, so... Why are you here? Who didn't hire a taxi? No money. I told you to take a jeepney. Anyhow, I can see her this, uh, this afternoon. Incidentally, I met Fred's mother a short while ago. Fred's mother? Yes, she was near the Martini's taxi station. What were you doing at the, ta at the taxi station? Trying to get a taxi on credit, I suppose. Anyhow, Fred's mother... What about her? She said she was coming today. What for? She didn't tell me. Fred's mother? You mean young Nina went out to the party last night? Yes, father. Did she see where she was coming? No, but she seems sorry at me. In fact, she seems sorry at you too, father. At me? She said, tell your father, Kiko, I'm going to see him. She called me Kiko? Yes. Didn't you say, don't Kiko at least? No, she simply said Kiko. Aba. Dinner served! Hey, don't shout out now! Who's she, mother? The new mayor, Domo. Mayor what? 
is the new servant. Hoy! What do you mean, Hoy? My name is Pablo. You can call me Paul. My name is Francisco. The senior who calls me Francis, but if ever Paquito, must I add another um, who is to call me Francis. What do you want? The senior wants you in the dining room. What for? These are delicious. That's your job. I'm not a muchacho. I'm a mayordomo. Didn't you answer this in over at the window? Wanted a muchacho? Yes. Why? Then you're like a muchacho like me. I want you to understand that I'm not a muchacho. Ha! Huh? You look like a common muchacho to me. Don't let me catch using these words again. Suplado! What are you doing here? Don't you know we're already eating? Where's Doña Petra? She's eating. Don't you dare touch my son. Chen! You can have that human jellyfish. 
coming here to say what might have happened? You should advise your daughter to stop going to parties and chaperones. People gossip her and lose my son. Mind your own business. Step to your son. Stop looking dumb. Che, I never saw such people. Che! Get out of here before I call the police. The police, no. mama, the police. We're going, che! Paul! Paul! Who's Paul? Petra. Yes, Don Francisco. Paul, kindly escort this and these people to the door. Roughly, Paul, roughly. Canaria, I suppose to entice my muchacho to come here. Hoy, I'm not a muchacho. I'm a mayordomo. Furthermore, Doña Petra pays me 80 pesos per month, while you used to give me 50 pesos only. 80 a month? Where did I get that much? Doña Dolores. Dolores de Cabeza. 80 a month? Che! Che! Can you imagine the insolence? Che! That was Nena Gar, for going on chaperon. I was already telling you, Petra. How could I know this Dolores make all that awful fuss? Do you want me to break Pell's neck? You should have done. That when he was here, your muscle reflexes are tidy, my son. Che! Don't cry, Nena. It's over. Making all this fuss for nothing? The truth is, I got a friend during the party and left him. Left him? Where did you go? I came home with Luding and Lolita. Fred's mother had been trying to interest me with his son. That's why he told his mother and... I, Iha, go in and take this as lesson to you. Che! Sit here beside me, Robertine. Incidentally, Robertine, I hope nothing happened to you last night. Last night? Yes, la last night. You went out with Mia, didn't you? Yes, but nothing happened, I think. You think? So my domos of owner cigar. Oh my god, my yabang. Get back to the kitchen, Francis. Are you still here, Senora? Yes, I suppose you'll have to be here to a while. I won't have to put up any more what the cigar. No, make another. Put one day the chaperon. One day the chaperon? Yes, for our daughter Nina. Yes, Perganza. I her mother will chaperon Nena. Robertine, Robertine! What is it, mother? Isn't it that your girlfriend, Lea? Why, yes! And who is that old man along with her? It's her father! And he's carrying something! It's a... It's a, it's a gun! Tied in my mouth! Ay, Petra! We need two chaperons! Check! 